The following narrative describes the patented ethos pyrolysis and gasification technology. Waste is loaded into the reception hoppers for processing. At the base of each hopper are two compactor screws designed to meter the waste into the pyrolysis process and provide an airtight seal. The seal ensures that the waste is pyrolyzed, heated in the absence of oxygen, rather than combusted. As the waste is transported down the pyrolysis tube and through the pyrolysis chamber, combustion gases at approximately 1,000 degrees Celsius indirectly heat the waste, converting it into carbon char and pyrolysis gas. As the carbon char is pushed out of the pyrolysis tube, it falls into the gasification chamber. The process of gasification releases gas from the char by the water-gas reaction. The combined pyrolysis and gasification gas is drawn under suction into the cyclone, where 95% of particulates are removed. A duct transports the gas from the cyclone to an injection port on the thermal oxidizer. It is here that the pyrolysis and gasification syn gas undergoes staged combustion. The gas follows a cyclonic path through the thermal oxidizer, which is maintained at an operational temperature of 1250 degrees Celsius. The cyclonic action of the gas at 1250 degrees Celsius helps ensure the complete destruction of any organic pollutants and particles. The combusted gases exit the thermal oxidizer and are drawn into the pyrolysis chamber to provide the heat for the pyrolysis process. As the gases exit the pyrolysis chambers, they recombine and pass through a steam boiler, where 85% of the available energy is captured and converted into steam. The boiler is designed to quickly reduce the exhaust gas temperature from 800 degrees Celsius to 220 degrees Celsius. The speed of temperature reduction helps to prevent the reformation of dioxins and furans. From the boiler, the gases pass through a bag filter, where sodium bicarbonate, commonly known as baking soda, is added to remove the acid gases and then through a denox catalyst to remove NOx. A duty standby pair of fans are located at the bottom of the stack. These fans produce the suction required to draw the gas through the plant. The discharge side of the fans push the clean exhaust gases up the stack, where they are continuously monitored and recorded.